for example, in that country. In Puerto Rico, the EV and they used are produced by a private company. Here in India, the machines we used are produced by public sector undertakings. Again, what is used in countries abroad uses a generic chip. It can be reprogrammed. Every election, we do not do that. We use a one-time. We use a one-time chip which is programmable only one time and it cannot be overwritten. Again, the third point is that the chip can be malfunctioned in the Puerto Rican EVM simply because it's, uh, it's used multiple times. That doesn't happen in India. The fourth and very important point is that problems are attributed to software issues. In India, the EVM doesn't use an operating system at all, which means it cannot be connected to Wi-Fi, it cannot be connected to Bluetooth. So the likelihood of anyone hacking this EVM, Salem Dharni Dharan, is as likely as somebody hacking your ceiling fan. I